All right, intro is unnecessary. Same part, really far in, still in fall. Tomorrow we're gonna grab some flowers. We're gonna stop by Francis and Natalia. Oh, it's raining again, so we don't have to water anything. And a whole bunch of other stuff. First, of course, let's feed our animals. Ah, you're all big now. That's good. Here you go, dinner. Looks like dinner is uh, big enough to let go. So uh, we made, with dinner being that big, they're worth three times as much as they were. Even more than, because they're worth 850 and I bought them for 250 so. Pretty worth it to get rid of dinner for that. There you go. All set. There you go. You're all good. Go ahead and relax for today. Boink. 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 Boink, boink. Alright. Grapes are done. That's good. Slice cabbage down. Probably gonna want to buy more seeds from Lena if that's all the stuff we have. But we can finally make wine now, so that's good. Hey Francis, how are you doing today? I finally convinced Angus to have our ceremony in the woods. The consciousness center is a non-starter, and town hall would just feel too shotgun wedding for me. After everything we've been through together, we deserve to have a real big day. That is true. That is true. You deserve a lot. Uh, let's see, you're buying gold for 45. That is good to know. Talia. Uh, let's see. Just need you to make this with gold bars. Thank you. Let's see, it's 3,000 each. Okay. We have the gold bars, but we are nowhere near at the level that we are going to be able to actually afford that. Good lord, that's actually so much. I guess let's go check on Give. Oh, right. Who else we need to check on Give? Uh... I guess Sophia is another one, right? All these people that want to rank up. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Mira wants to. Give on Francis. We just checked Francis. He didn't make it for us. We can check with Giva today before they close. Nope, Sophia's just uh, stuck at good friend. Because we're maxed out with them, but they're stuck at good friend. Okay, that's fine. And Violet. Violet also as well. Alright, guess we'll stop by Giva. Here. 
Nothing here. Closed again. Oh, you're open Saturday. Crap. Okay. Pine cones and such, okay. Some wood I forgot. <laughs> One day we will rank up with these people. Let's check what's on the beach. <laughs> Actually, we should also talk with, uh, Thomas. We haven't talked in a bit. Temperatures are dropping, but we still got fall crops to get in the ground. After all, planting season's not over lentil, it's over. Thomas, Ooh. did you just make a pun? <laughs> I knew that baker was going to rub off on me if I kept stopping by for croissants. That is... Such a shame. <gasps> Soybean season. That's important. Make soy milk out of that. There's a lot of stuff down here. Hold on, wait. Then I checked. Over there? Alright, we're good. Alright, stop by the store, get some more seeds. Probably don't need any more grapes, but we should just get them anyways, along with pumpkins. So what are you buying grapes for? 30? Okay. And you sold the seeds for 25, so yeah, that's actually not good at all. It's, it's going to be much better to turn this into wine and sell it, because you are... You are not giving me much. <laughs> you are not giving me much. Oh, hey, Cameron. Give is not interested in joining the league, but no matter. I still enjoy hearing about her work. Oh, has she told you anything interesting lately? Well, it's all interesting if you care about science and progress. That is true. That is true. Hey, guy, what do you got? A mulberry seedling. I don't need any more of those. Thank you, though. New silkworms and olives. Hmm, I'll have to stop by another day. Oh well, I'm sure I'll buy something. I should get a couple flower seeds while I'm out, actually. Yeah, a couple more tiger lily bulbs. Hey. And, hey, what do you need now? I'm so excited to see what you think. Oh, right. Actually, I might have overcatered a bit, so I've got a few for you. Thanks for all your help. No, thank you. I completely forgot you made it. Holy moly, thank you. Marmalade pudding. Let's go. Um, where is it? There it is. Well, I can't actually tell how high it is until I use my energy, so. Guess we'll have to find a use for that, won't we? It's raining, so it's gonna go down quick, so I guess today can be a mine day, because we're gonna be using up our energy anyways. Uh, it's gonna be soybeans planted. Four days, two days, okay. Two days, and the cabbage up here should be done, right? One day, okay. Tomorrow that's gonna be done. Let's go ahead and put down these tiger lilies here. We're just gonna have a ton of flowers around these beehives. Alright. 
Yeah, you're already gaining a lot of traction. Okay. Oh, hey, Gibba. Marty hiked all the way up here to drop off a flyer for his election bid. I didn't have the heart to tell him he needn't to bothered. Otto hasn't come round at all, of course. Damn. Seems... <laughs> Otto is actually really unpopular as mayor. But I'm kind of scared to have Marty be mayor, man. Like, I just... I don't know... We don't know anything about him. Like, we're cool and all, but... He hasn't actually told us anything about himself. He's, he's a consultant. So that's He used to be a consultant. That's all we know. I don't know. Hopefully the election doesn't do anything too special. Otto actually hasn't asked for any help this campaigning either, so... It's not like I could help him if I wanted. But Marty's asked, everybody else has asked. Oh well. I'm sure things will work out the way they're supposed to. You don't trust politicians? But what if what if somebody is pretending to be a politician? Do you trust them more? For me, it's not really like a... It's not about if I trust them. It's just about what are they doing right now. And, and so far, Marty's just... Literally is just our rancher right now. He, and Otto's like, he's been doing a job for a bit, and it's not like he's, he hasn't been doing a bad job, he's just been making decisions that aren't popular with smaller shops. But the place runs fine, he made sure that he asked me to get the bridge fixed, he's... All in all, he's been pretty decent. Rancher doesn't like being a rancher. Yeah, who also takes a uh, pick to twit photos of the animals to, like, show off the people. So, like, what if he just doesn't want to be a mayor anymore? The bully just up and run? He'll just be like, no, nah, I want to be a rancher. You can have it back. <laughs> That's more what I'm worried about. He d yeah, I mean... But if he wanted to be famous, he didn't have to be a... I don't think your road to fame starts with being a farmer. <laughs> I think if you were going to be famous, you'd probably choose a couple other lines of work initially. Gosh, there are rocks in here, man. I guess. I guess. Okay, you're out of strength. Well, that's that's okay. We have chocolate cupcakes for that. You're gonna you're gonna work until I say so, Tara. We're trying to get to the bottom of this mine. The door is right there. Oh lord, you are running out of time though, so if you could find the key today, that would be awesome. Oh, looks like we're out of regular rocks, so we're gonna be breaking the Hey, ah, perfect. this looks like a key to the next level. Alright, let's get out of here. Hmm. Nothing special on this floor either, same as before. I guess we'll it's probably smarter if we just speedrun and look for a chest. Oh my lord, look how big this place is. Ooh, what's that door? What's inside? I can Recipe, greatest hits. I can make kimchi and sauerkraut now. What is that? I need to find the key to this. Oh, that's crazy. Hey, that's a crazy looking door. Hold on. Okay, so if we come down to this floor, we're gonna need to we're gonna need to stop time spell because holy moly, this floor is massive. Stop time and a lot of muffins. There we go. 
go. Is there anything down here I need to do? Yeah, get my essences. Uh, yeah, more copper. Not anything I need to do here. Items are people, so I could just ask where somebody's handing out right now. Okay. Crystal ball potion needs red dye, so I guess we could just start that. All right, we'll do the crystal ball potion. All right, to the bed. I'm sleepy. Rain's gonna carry over from tomorrow. I believe a lot of these should be done soon. Yeah, these are all good. My mulberries are good. I have grapes. Oh, I got two leaves that time. That's actually really nice. Click this. Uh, get my glass. I forgot that was in there. Let's actually start making some wine. Got all the stuff for it, and we can make a grape juice. Got a lot of stuff we can be doing. Um, are any of the beehives on yet? No, no, they are not. So you won't head back to that bottom floor of the mine just yet. Instead. Well, let's go feed our animals first. Here you go, dinner. You're getting pretty big. Here you are, chicken. You dinner. There we go. We'll tear. Cool. And the last we got nuggets. That should be good. All right, Saturday. Will give up be available? Want to get to know her better. Oh, hey, Marotta. Ah, you do have a request for me. Ah, there's one of my favorite citizens. I want to make a banner to hang up at our victory party in the mayor's mansion. Auto soft, Fairhaven strong. Oh, victory party. Feeling confident, I see. Why wouldn't I be? Has anyone said they actually plan to vote for the new guy? They hardly know him. <laughs> of course they don't. Anyway, could you supply me with some fabric for the banner? Yeah, sure. Sure. No problem. Excellent. I'm impartial. It's going to be the best banner any mayor ever had. Huge. Need some silk? Yeah, I got you one for you. Fabric yet? There you go. Yes, here you go. Fantastic. Thanks for doing your part to make my celebration a success. I wish I could extend an invitation, but it's really just a few dozen of my closest donors. I, I mean, friends. Uh -huh. Sure, thanks for the money, bud. I'm so pleased to officiate Angus and Francis's wedding, although I understand Messenger Connor is rather disappointed. Maybe he could officiate a recommitment ceremony for Vanessa and me instead. Maybe, Yada. All right, Giva, can we finally talk? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, come in, come in, Tara. Careful, I'm up in. Oh, I'm so 
celebrating. I've just finished analyzing my first set of barometric readings. They suggest there's some sort of pressure barrier around the island. There really is something odd happening here. Tell me, have you noticed anything dodgy about the weather since you've arrived? Uh, yeah, actually. Well, yes, but I am just a simple country farmer, ma'am. <laughs> Couldn't tell you a thing about the weather. A simple city girl turned farmer, you mean? I know you came here in the spring. I have to get to the bottom of this. What was grad school for otherwise? Sometimes I wasn't certain I'd make it. But now, here I am, in my own weather observatory. Oh, listen to me, Ramble. You're very kind, Tara. Come back anytime. Thank you. It's so nice to meet an intelligent character. And not intelligent just in, like, they have good head on their shoulders, like she's actually just super smart. There's not actually many people like that in town. There's just a bunch of wise and people. I found something. A recipe. For corn soup. That's it. <laughs> it's just corn soup. Is it? It is. A recipe. And spring stew. Well, that's horribly out of date. Alright. It's Saturday. Is there anything I need to do Saturday? I've got a lot of food and a lot of spells. I think my Saturdays are fine, actually. Check my potions for one. That's something I can do. Good. Crystal ball. Who do I want to give stuff to? There's gotta be something I actually don't have a lot of points with. Cause there's a lot of people I'm just ranking up like crazy. And I'm already friends with Marty. You know what, Crystal ball, what is auto like? I think I see something. Oh no, there's something about everybody. Fruit punch. You know, I could believe him just wanting to be a little kid and just loving some fruit punch. I could definitely see the mayor being like that. Let's see. Ah, I need more. I need more powdered calcium. And some more essence of copper. Powdered calcium is easy enough. We have plenty of shells. Can we make any fruit punch? Is that something we have access to? No. No, we don't. Watch alcohol. <laughs> Pumpkin spice latte. And some milk shakes. We need a lot of milk for... A... We're getting to the point where we need a lot of milk for a lot of things. Whatever. It's in our problem just yet. Other stuff where I'm doing. Six hours left and they'll be done. Cool. Our wine will be another four days. In that case, I'll just... Can I make some boost harvest potions? No, I need conch shells. I guess we'll have to go see if we can find any on the beach. Because if wine takes that long, I would like to sell it. Thank you. Let's see if we can find some conch shells. Oh, hey, Sophia. I wish Angus and Francis were having one of those fancy ceremonies where everyone dresses to the nines. But not every wedding can be like mine. That is true. Ah, we got one conch shell. Not the best, but it'll do. Uh, I mean, I guess we could also tr check if, see if, um, Shelby's selling any conch shells. Yeah, it's better than nothing. Let's go ahead and check. Ah, 
Hiya, how you doing? Let's see here. I think it's oh oh. I'm exhausted. And to think, I believe that moving here would mean a slower paced life. I feel like I have to work even harder because I'm the only one responsible for the whole town's health. You do seem really busy. One woman I dated said I use work as an excuse to not get close to anyone. She just didn't understand the pressure. I do play 14. I play quite a lot, actually. Yeah, that's, uh, it's my character from when I had her, uh, what is it? What's it called? When you when you used a potion to change their race, I'd done that for a little bit as like a little challenge for myself, and I decided to like make her into a little moving model for myself. One woman I dated said I used works. She didn't understand the pressure. Uh, eh, it's probably her. Maybe you would have made time if she was someone you really wanted to be with. I bet you'll open up when you find the right person. Ugh, ouch. That's harsh, but probably true. I just wasn't that into her, I guess. Maybe I'm just a hopeless romantic, but I do think I would commit to someone special. Ah, <sighs> thanks for letting me vent. No problem, I feel yeah. like taking a day off soon. But like a real day <laughs> off, not paying bills and doing yeah, laundry. Yeah, nice. Maybe if you're free, we could get a drink sometime? Oh, absolutely. Hello. <laughs> Yeah, let's go. Yeah, Wild Powers is pretty good. It's uh, it's definitely a good game. I picked, I uh, won in a contest, and uh, I'm I've been enjoying it the whole time. I'm looking fall now. It's cool that you play fourteen as well. Do you uh, do you like main a job or do any raiding, or you just you just enjoy the story? Uh, let's see. You need anything else for your wedding? I will do anything you need for your wedding. <laughs> White mage do savage. Oh, okay, oh, that's that's awesome. Yeah, I just recently finished the last for the tier. My static was having a lot of trouble, but after some pushing, we finally I finally got him to actually take a P8 more seriously. So we finally got that clear, and now everybody's just getting their bis. So it's actually been, it's been pretty nice these last couple times. Francis is gonna rank up at some point. Oh, whoa, whoa, Angus, you alright? I keep pinching myself. I still can't believe I'm getting married. I know, I'm excited for I you. I had a hard time telling guys I was interested, so I didn't have that many boyfriends before Francis. Luckily, Francis is pretty good at asking for what he wants. Yeah, that's pretty happy for you. So, Progrepetus, yeah, I mean, it's, it's tough. It is really tough. Especially since uh, if you ever try to get more and more practice in PF, some days it just feels like you're wasting your time. Hey, Parker, what do you need? You look like you're in a good mood. I am. Angus is getting married soon, and he's one of my best buddies. I'm so happy for him and Francis. Oh, that's sweet. I love a wholesome romance. Same here. I want to get Angus the best wedding present. Not the most expensive, but the most meaningful, you know? Yeah. Here's my plan. Take a photo of them, blow it up, and print it on silk. Then I'll frame it with dried turtle head flowers. Francis likes to give Angus big bouquets of turtle heads. Hey, what if I pay you for some turtle heads and silk? How could I turn down such a cute request? Yeah, I'm kidding. Knew you'd understand. Thanks, Tara. Silk and turtle head flower. I actually have all of that. So yeah, absolutely. Yo, take if it's for their like I said, if it's for their wedding, I'll do anything you need. Way ahead of you. This is exactly what I needed. Thanks so much. Lena says I like craft projects more than a sorority girl, but what can I say? I enjoy making things for people I care about. True. Oh, Parker, never change. Not at all. <laughs> Thanks again for helping me out. I couldn't do it without you. Here. Thank you. P1 through 12, P1 through 7. Oh, Lord. I didn't actually get into rating until uh, E8. Oh, sorry, E9. Because I, I came in towards the end of Shadowbringers. I, I only just started playing it, like, a little bit before 5.5 .5 came out. So I started pretty late, but I got caught up pretty quick. I was kind of obsessed for a little bit. I've taken it a lot slower since then. 
flowers are good. Bees are good. Chickens are good. I do know the fish sticks trick. Uh, I'm low on money because I recently uh, bought this. And the last thing I bought was the uh, the barn. So I uh, expunded all my funds. My funds are gone. <laughs> I do not have much left for anything. But uh, I've... I haven't been trying since I... I looked it up after... I ended up making money with fish sticks. Like, I, I was really surprised about how the food economy was in this game. And then after looking up, I found out that it's a very common thing to just make mad money off of uh, buying, buying fish and flour. And, like, that's all right, but I feel like that's something I'll do more in a secondary playthrough just because I don't really... I don't have a need to be absolutely rich right now. Especially at this point in the game, like, there's a lot of stuff for me to do. I feel like if I was mad rich from the beginning, I would find much less to do with my day. Especially in summer. Oh my god, if I had everything done in summer, this game would be so boring right now. I would just be running back and forth talking to people. Anybody need anything today? Okay, I guess we're done with here for the time being. I need to go water these plants, though. Come on, Violet. Hey, different things for different people, yeah. Having, a, having an absurd amount of money is always fun. That's not, like, I know, I know I feel that way in Stardew when I play with my friends and I make, like, tons and tons of money a day and they just they get the fish or mine or whatever. Like, I, I enjoy it in that game. I don't know why, but for some reason in this game, I like taking things a lot slower. Let's see, I don't think, uh, yeah, I don't have a plant for that yet. Yeah, you, yeah, Clam spends their entire time making tons and tons of mayo on their little section of their farms. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope. I'm full on magic. I don't have any honeycomb. So we're just chilling. We just need to use our energy up on something. How are we doing on wood? 148. Uh, we can just clear out this bit. And we'll probably be good on wood for a good, good while. There you go. Oh lord. The longer I don't have to look and gather all these materials, the better. I want to go back to the mine, but the, the mine is so quiet. It, they really need to put some type, like, just some very quiet, simple song in the mines, so that it's not all you hear is the tink tink of your pickaxe. Alright, that should be good. We're probably good on wood for the foreseeable future until we get that hay barn, that hay field that uh, Parker wants for us. I guess the next money goal is going to be a cow. I think that's going to that's gonna be our next goal. Alright, what do we got here? Nothing going. I do need a boost harvest, because I need it for my wine. These coppers are done. We'll do two more, just so we have a little bit overflow. Don't think I need any of these. I need more ink, okay. Well, as much as I like to pretend that I don't have anything to make it. Yeah, that's true. I could have everything instantly if I did that. It's all right, though. It's gonna feel a little bit more natural from my tarot that she uh, takes everything a little bit slower. 
Why would I need more than one desk? That's dumb. That's true, you do get a ton of everything. I'm kind of like overflowing in eggs already, just from the four chickens I got, so it'll be alright. I'll probably just wait till I go through this game like a second time. I'm sure I'll find the energy for that. If I go through it a second time, then I'll uh, cat myself really early and see how I can really min-max this game. Because I do like to do that with some games, just absolutely break it. Uh, let's see, I don't need a drink per se. Let's get a couple muffins. Ooh, running out of flour. Okay, we're gonna have to go buy some flour. All right. Is it time for bed? Set the bed. Morning, Damon. Oh. What brings you by? What's up, Damon? The debate is today. Oh. You won't believe what happened. Damon? What's wrong? I left the pie with a note for Otto from Vanessa earlier, but Otto left the <gasps> pie on the table and Cameron just ate it. That is so rude of him. Uh, he's gonna pay for it pretty fast. We should uh, get going so we don't miss any of the action. Cameron ate it? <laughs> uh, I wouldn't miss it. Pass the popcorn. <laughs> you sound like Violet. I think she's the only other person hoping Otto goes down in flames. Okay. Lead the way. Thank you all for coming to our first and last mayoral debate. Mr. Emerson and Mayor Soft have asked me to moderate. First question goes to Mayor Soft. <laughs> oh, uh, messenger? <laughs> Goodness me. Um, sorry. Um, yeah, allergies. Um, allergies. <laughs> Happens to everyone, right? <clears throat> Uh, what do you plan to do about the scourge of malcontents plaguing our fair town? Uh-oh, here we go. Thank you for the very neutral and fair question, <laughs> Messenger Connor. I plan to strengthen our community by growing God, a lot of so watch funny. program and implementing a strict curfew of 10 p.m. Oh. It will be easier to spot the unsavory characters when law town curfew. citizens are safe at home. What? That will torpedo my business! If we could please hold audience questions until the end. Uh, you don't have the right to tell us what to do. This is still a free town. I think the freedom to live in a safe town is the most important thing a mayor can give his constituents. Thank you, Mayor Soft. Now, on to a question for Marty Emerson. Mr. Emerson, as a noob to the town, how can you already more than the... Messenger, is this debate a joke to you? I'm feeling a bit, um, unwell. Yes, that's it. Let me um, try again. Mr. Emerson, as a new arrival to the town, how can you already claim to know what it needs more than the incumbent? Well, you're a new arrival, and you're the debate moderator. I... Uh, that is not an answer. Uh, I'm just teasing you, Cam. You're doing a great job. Everyone in this town works really hard. And they deserve a mayor who works hard for them. Sure, we could maintain the status quo, but why not dream bigger? When I look at this town, I see so much potential. So typical. What's wrong with our town the way that it is? If you have a problem with it, move back to the city. Uh, again, if we could save questions until the end. Mm, I don't agree with that. New people should be heard. Why can't new arrivals to town have an opinion, Thomas? Of course we can. Under my leadership, all Fairhaven citizens would be treated like equals. I'm ready to take Fairhaven forward into the future. I hope you'll all join me. Thank you, Mr. Emerson. That concludes our mail. You know, considering I helped get your ranch restored, I would have thought you might have some gratitude. Oh, I didn't realize I was supposed to pay that debt with loyalty. Oh, is Mayor Soft into paying debts now? Oh, <laughs> oh no, my God, Francis! Bad. Everyone. Bro, how strong did you make that pie? Otto really imposes a curfew. He'll never do it. 
Bruno doesn't even leave the bar before 10 most nights. I hope you're right. Also, what the heck was up with Cameron? I'm not at liberty to say. Let's just say he committed a major debate foul. Ugh, Damon. Man, okay. <laughs> Why in the world? Man, I was actually kind of wanting Mayor Otto to be reelected, but uh, if all he wants to do is to kind of control what everybody's doing, it makes me really, it makes it kind of hard to want to vote for him, man. And Marty didn't give anything really at all about what he wanted to do for the town. God, I'm still thinking about it. That I don't know who to vote for. That actually made it really hard and not for any good reason. Both do not seem like good choices. It kind of seems like Marty is just got a bunch of ideas but no way to back them up. Mayor Otto's been privileged the whole time to be mayor. So he doesn't have anything worth adding to the town. You voted for Marty? Yeah. I could see... Like, I can see a reason to vote for them both, just because Otto actually knows what he's doing, even if he's really annoying with some things. And Marty is going to make it a lot better for the coven, but I don't know. I'm going to have to think on it some more. There's like a week before the election. Can't actually vote? Ah, I see. Even regardless, I've been telling people I've been, I'm going to vote for Otto, so that might influence it. I'm not sure. Don't want to know, by the way. Don't want to know if if what I'm doing influences anything. Just this is completely blind, so I'm gonna keep it that way. Are you a good witch or a bad witch? Hey, excuse me. Uh, what? Mrs. Soft designed this oh, oh, thank God. for reading class. <laughs> I bet you would be a good witch. And Mayor Soft is totally the wizard. God, that kid scared me. <laughs> oh my lord. I may be biased, but I think Mayor Soft made his case for why he deserves four more years. Do you always call him Mayor Soft? I mean, you're his wife. Yes. Is that odd? Uh, that's a little odd. Only a little, though. Need to go collect some stuff on the beach. Excuse me. Nice seaweed. And we'll go ahead and check the other. I still need to talk to Cameron about today, so I'll have to check out a consciousness center as well. How did you think today went? So what did you think of Otto's speech at the debate? I don't know. I stand a better chance of getting paid if he keeps his job, right? But it's the principle of the thing. I can see that. Yeah, there ain't no shame in pick whoever you pick. Man, he must have... Damon must have loaded up that potion with some strong juice <laughs> to get him clucking life up. Hey man, how you feeling? I've asked Wesley if he'd like to carry the Book of the Mind at his bookstore, but he keeps saying no. I don't understand. It's a great opportunity. I... Yeah, it's just not the kind of book Wesley really sells. Yeah. It's a little more... It's not exactly rare. Nice job moderating the debate, Cameron. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. It, it was definitely a little more charged than normal. Oh, hey, what's up? Hi, Tara. Good to see you here. D do you come often? Uh, not really. Well, that's okay. Everyone has to walk the path at their own pace, as Messenger Cameron says. I grew up going to Mass, so it took me a while to feel comfortable here, knowing my parents won't approve. And Francis's snarky remarks don't help. I mean, it's a little unusual. They'll come around. But I can see why your family and Francis might find the League a bit unusual. Well, it definitely is new. 
but they shouldn't be so quick to judge before they've even given it a chance. I think the Book of the Mind can really help people. Look, I feel real acceptance here. Like, I can be in charge of my own destiny, you know? It's about hope. Hey, never gonna doubt you for it. So, what did you think about the election? Hey, did the debate help you make up your mind about who to vote for, Angus? Maybe. Promise not to tell Francis? <laughs> sure. No. Uh, Oh, I can't say it. Well, but I guess I already gave it away. I hope he won't be too mad at me. I don't think he'll be mad at you. Like, he understands. While we're here... Here, I got something new for you. Some turtle head flour, Grandma. We have chickens now, Grandma. Well... A chick. Barker fixed up the coop. It looks just like it did when I was little. Gosh, I didn't realize she had more dialogue for the okay. Yeah, we do love grandma. Hey Kai, what's up? What do you got today? Orange and lemon? Ooh, I do need a lemon tree. Take that, thank you. Uh, I don't need this last piece of silk for anything, so I will slide that to you back. Kai, I, I don't expect m much, but what do you think about the election? Did the debate impact your vote, Kai? No way, my dude. Marty crushed it. He's my bro. I see. One track mind. Alright, let's go ahead and get this tree planted. It's going to be a while until it grows, so we kind of want to get started on it early. Also got to feed the chickens. I wasn't able to do that. There we go. Let's go ahead and put one of these down here. Uh, let's see. Here we are. 15 days. Good lord. Can't water it either. Uh, did I pick up any more flower seeds? No, 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 they're growing. Okay, I was gonna say. Ooh, I do have two things of honey done though. Nice. Oh, that's like three bees. Oh, it's so good. You know what that means? Take that, take that. Take this, take this. Got four, got four, got none. I need mint. Uh, we're, we're always going to need that, because we need Spirit Flame over time. Uh, I don't need anything here. Go ahead and make two of these. Perfect, okay. Well, we know what we're doing to spend our energy. I do need to water my plants, though. Peepeel. What, what does that mean? What do you mean, Neeps? People what? Mm. Uh, I can plant something here. I, don't... I could probably make it to the flower shop in time to buy something. If it's open. Tuesday through Saturday. Nope, not open. That's fine. Alright, chickens, I didn't forget about you. It's time to eat. This drummer doesn't know. I don't know! <laughs> You're gonna have to educate me. There you go, Chimpkin. Dinner, how you doing? We also got nuggets. You know I don't have a lot of emotes turned on, so if this is emote specific, I have not set it up. <laughs> I got a little Terra. Hmm. 
You will be a big and strong chicken, never to be sold. Alright, there's all that. We can't sell anymore. I don't want to make more plots because I'm lazy. My pumpkins are done, though. There you go. Gotta water all these. I almost forgot because of uh, the mayor meeting today. Make sure my soybeans get watered, too. I can finally start making some soy milk. It's a good thing I checked in with uh, Thomas. I don't usually. Alright. Uh, let's go ahead and get some more soybeans down. Because I want to... Because I do not want to have to constantly wait on a cow for milk. I could just make soybeans and get a bunch of soy milk. Only takes seven days as well. And we could always give it a little boost if we want it earlier. Lastly, we'll put some more pumpkins down. All right, all set. Uh, let's go ahead and refill the can. I already know who you're voting for, Natalia. I don't even have to check. Whatever's in our messenger's favor, right? Let's see. We have a bunch of food, so... Let's see if we can get to the next floor, and then I'll go ahead and call this part for YouTube. Alright, first things first. Gears that turn and clocks that time. Stop your work of telling time. There we go. Off to a fantastic start so far with no gold, I guess. <laughs> nope, nope, not. Yep, thank you. I'm just saying I don't want to waste energy on that. Oh, Lord, we're going to be down here a while, actually. This is going to be a really long part. <laughs> Please. Uh, I do have another lock picking spell so I can open this. What's inside? I cannot see. I'll open you up and set you free. Yay. What's inside? Ooh, another letter. Dad, if I make it out alive, I'm never coming back to this mine again. The keys to the lower levels keep going missing one by one. I was on level four, and the door slammed, and I heard the most awful shriek you can ever imagine. The boys and I talked it over, and we are decided. We're quitting as soon as we get this week's pay. I'll see you soon. Got it. Man, something really didn't want them down on this mine. I must get to the bottom. I must know. <laughs> Best part about wildflowers right here. Go into the mines for no music and hitting rocks. <laughs> Living life. <laughs> there you go, there you go. There you go. Wrap around, and there's all these... God, it's so much! There's so much! There's so much distance to cover. Oh, man. I'm definitely gonna get some value. 
at his uh, stop time potion. Good god. There was two chests in here. I didn't even realize that. Okay, so we missed one initially. There we go. Nice, we're getting gold. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there it is. There's the gold. Make so much jewelry with that. Hey, this looks like a key to the next level. All right, sounds good. We will check that out after we clear out the rest of these little stones. Let's see, I've got four out of the five notes. So hopefully this next floor has the last one. This floor 20. Oh, ooh. A waterfall down here, okay. Okay, okay. A lot more consistent gold, too. Yo, that's so cool, okay. I didn't realize there's an underground river. So let's take a look around. What's actually in here? Is this the bottom? There's a chest over here. Oh wait, I, I think I have a scroll. I can open this. Is this my last note? What's inside? I cannot see. I'll open you up and set you free. It is not an Anzac biscuit, avocado toast, an avo avo latte. What is that? It's a latte served in an avocado shell. Some made it as a joke, but now it's a real thing. That's terrible. Why would anybody have that? Man, come on. <laughs> That's so bad. That does not sound good at all. I don't even like avocados that much. That sounds even worse. <laughs> this does, however, look like it's the bottom of the mine. So that's good to know. Let's see. Yeah, we made it to the bottom of the mine. All right. Of course, you'd try it. You'd be like, oh, yes, the avocado gives it that nice bland flavor I like. <laughs> this is all watered. How's our wine doing? See, you got three days left. Delicious? Absolutely not. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, go ahead and make some more, little guy. Alright, I don't think we get any potions set up, do we? No. Only one or boost harvest, anyways. I don't really need anything to be done faster. I guess for now, just go ahead and get some silver essence down. Since that's what we're actually using. And that's where we're going to call this part here for YouTube, so. We got a lot done today. That that election was a, not election, that debate was a disaster. I really didn't like it. Not like from a game perspective, but like just as me, I was like, I didn't like either side in that. So it kind of feels like no matter who we get as mayor, it's not going to be good for anybody unless they really change themselves. But we'll see. So if you stuck around to the end, I appreciate it. And I will see you in the next one.